Welcome back to Ebola 2. Where can we left off? Killing the boss. I can't actually remember what else. One of the things I actually wanted to also do. Also, can I shoot this? No. Um, I gotta look for more of those one out of five coins that I shot by the werewolf. Actually, what was the other things? I got lockpicks. I got more things to burn. I killed the boss. I, what was I doing? I'm gonna have to rewatch my last episode, to be honest. It was like, I needed to... I can't even remember. Yeah, I'll be right back. I'm gonna check my old video. Alright. So I double-checked. Also, I guess I gotta change my brightness a little. Just so I can see it a little better. I've never remembered seeing a phone. I need bolt cutters for that. I remember going through this in the last episode. I just watched it. I said I had to probably go to the seventh floor. But I don't know if I've ever seen a telephone. I think I want to try to find the telephone. Someone I remember saying... Oh, wait. Inspect the eighth floor. Oh, never mind. Inspect the eighth floor. Someone said they think they saw a phone in the boiler room. I don't see how... Um, it really doesn't matter. I mean, I'm sure that maybe they'd give me a reward, but I, I don't know. I don't know. Because there'd likely be a telephone. Hmm. It could be telephone, honestly, anywhere. Even in a save point. Actually, save point. Isn't there, like, phones around here? There's so many places I'd have to check, to be frank. I don't know. I'd, I'm just going to skip ahead and maybe just try to find that phone first and foremost, just so I know if it's... And yeah, just to check places. I don't know. I'm curious. I, I really don't think it's in this break room, though. I mean, I got I got the ammo, but I don't want to burn zombies, you know? We're going we're gonna to fuck them up, though, just for the fun of it. No? Huh? No? See, there could be any one of these rooms that just happens to have a phone sitting up. Like... Yeah, like this! But I can't use it. So who knows? There's plenty of phones that I've seen, I just don't know if any of them are accessible. I don't remember ever touching a phone. Or seeing a phone being actionable. So, you know what? If there is a phone model, but I can't interact with it, just like that one, then I'll, I'll wait till another time. There could be a phone that's just in our pathway as we're playing the game still, so let's just... Let's just not even bother doing what I was going to do of just check every single floor. A key is required. How am I supposed to inspect the eighth floor? Seems a little impossible if I need a fucking key, unless it's in my treasure box when I left it in the save area. Yeah, this requires doggies. I need someone's head. Hmm. What more do I have, then? Hmm. I'm not sure. I'll double check with sex. Maybe I can ask them to say, hey, I need a key. Otherwise, I'm not sure. I had to go back to the boiler room when I fought the boss. Oh, wait. Um, the dog holds the key in his mouth. He can try to pull it out. Sure, do it. Oops. Uh, click. Am I supposed to drag? What? <laughs> okay. Thanks for the jump scare, I guess. Exit. I was expecting that, so I mean, nice try. I think now inspecting me. I didn't see that dog, and that's dumb. The amount of predictable forced jump scares is one too many. The bathtub, like in the last episode, it's just unnecessary. Maybe we'll get some lame-ass compilation with a bunch of fucking YouTubers fucking screaming and flying off their chair, but... I wonder if I'd actually be running into werewolves again. You know what? Just in case, the shotgun's coming out first. Oh. 
in this situation. Oh, fast zombie? What? Um... What is that? Okay. Can I kill it? What the fuck is it? Might have to burn it. Burn it? Burn it? Burn it? No? We can't burn it? I don't want it to revive again, man. I would have wished to burn it instead, but... Hmm... Alright, well... Oh. Oh, that's towards the boss, then. Hmm... Let's... Hmm... Oh god! God damn it, really? They lunged me towards the stupid plant thing. I backed up and the game still did it. Can I burn it? No. It's a plant. We're still fine, but... I'm not appreciative of the forced jump scares. There we go. No breaking. Uh... Revolver ammo? Doors jammed. Oh, shit. Okay, we got radio remote. Elephant Project. The Elephant Project has a rapid regeneration speed, which makes using small caliber weapons just pointless. The feature of this project is a high level of intelligence. The elephant has one big eye, which allows him to clearly see things from a great distance. A weak point. Elephant doesn't tolerate high temperatures. Hmm, temperatures of the high range. Gee whiz, there just happens to be a big oven in this map. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Hmm. Giant, hmm. I wish I could... Yeah, we do have a save point over here, so... Let's just, uh... Yeah, let's check the generator. A keys record. Let's get to the save point, then. You slow, whatever. Pistol. Okay. No. Ooh, more more fuel. Oh, just, just two. Just two? Ah, uh, oh yeah, put the note away. The note's garbage. Fuck the note. Useless waste of space. Revolver ammo. Mmm, tasty. Plant. Use. Wait, we're still just fine? Okay, we need more. Alright. No phone, ink. Four ink, Jesus. That's a, a bit much. Hmm. So what else should we do? We need a key to get into the generator room, which we likely... We need the generator turned on probably to fight the boss with the oven. That's my guess. So we need to go back to floor... Uh, four to do the remote control. Probably did get the key to the generator room to turn on the oven, is likely my guess. Because perhaps we'd get to fight the boss without the oven by shooting the eye. Unless, like, the regeneration is, like, infinite. Who knows. But, uh, fuck it. Put the ink away and uh, go back to the remote control car in the vent. Might have to fight a werewolf, not sure. But all the monsters in here will probably all respawn. It's the only shitty thing about having to change floors. God damn it. 
saw that happening. Oh, nice. Nice. Uh, more revolver ammo. Back to the save we're going. Alright, to the vents we go. Actually, you know what? I'll check to see if I can even open this. Oh, we, we can. I don't trust. He's just going to the boss room, basically. So yeah, no, nah, we're gonna do the remote control thing first and to see if I was right about the, um, four. To see if I'm right about the whole turning on the generator for the big oven. Because then, if, whenever we, when I finish the uh, remote control car, I'm gonna save it on this floor. On the, what was it? The eighth floor? Yeah, we'll save it in break three and then check out the big oven. Possibly get another boss fight. Also, just in case we're wolves. Yeah, good to go. Especially though, as I said though, I haven't seen any other coin thing for me to shoot, so I'm gonna have to wonder just how secretive they are. Because the one I shot was really obvious. So I'm kind of curious. Alright. What? Oh, cool. Oh, where are we? We can actually turn and shit? Oh my god. That's cool, but where the fuck are we going? It's so slow as well. It's like its batteries are shit. Maybe you can pick up items while doing this. 1928. Floor 1. Huh. Alright, well, I'll write that down. Cool. Um. I like how it's like S says cancel when it's actually just reverse. And going backwards is incredibly... Oh my god. I, I want to see if there's more things in the vent. Especially if there's like more coins that if I run into they'll break sort of thing. Because I'm kind of curious on what the coins mean. Well, let's just hope we don't ugh, have to reverse much anymore. Yeah, this goes up. Like, you gotta go this way now. I'm curious about so much what's in the... Ah, fuck. Can I, like, just, just backwards? Please tell me I can without, like, jamming. Maybe. Yeah, I think we can. <laughs> that, it's a pain, but we can do it. Okay. I go to the left. We must find out what is in these vents. I like this, though. This is cool. A, f a fully functioning remote control car. It's just so slow that it's, like, it's low battery. I haven't played with a remote control car for ages, man. Childhood memories. I remember I had a cool remote control car, though. My remote control... Ah, oh, goddammit. My remote control car was epic because... It was like, you know, if your if you remote, control, remote control car ever flipped over or flipped on its side or on its back, it was useless. Mine had it where it was like, it had really fat, puffy wheels. And if it flipped, it just became a different color, but the exact same car, basically. So no matter if it flipped, it could just like, keep driving. It was cool. It was like a spider. I don't know. It's not, not really... Oh, oh. A metal key, you think... You need to think about how to... What? And you think about how to get it. Wait, but... What do you mean, how to get it? Like, add a magnet to the car? Also, am I at the start again? The fuck, man? How many things are hidden in these stupid fucking vents? Okay, wait, not this way. Is it just the key, then, that's there? I don't have to imagine I have to put, like, a magnet on this. How else would I get something that's in the vents? A metal key, you need to think about how to get it. Hmm. Alright, well, we had to go to the first floor, I guess. I mean, no. First floor... Actually, hmm. Technician's room? Well... Well, I guess we'll be going to the first floor. 
Have I done this already or no? One, nine, two, eight. Ho. Oh, magnet, here we go. Gotcha. I was wondering, I, I, I had to see the safe really, 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 really early in my playthrough. This was, oh, the safe I had forgotten. I thought this was like also the safe when I first, for, first saw it now. Uh, that it was probably the safe that I already opened for the uh, assault rifle. Guess I was wrong. Either way, um, we have the we have Meg now. As I was thinking, we'd need. I'll check out everything else one more time, then call this floor done. I'll double check the boiler room as well. There's nothing in this boiler room, let alone a phone. I mean, they had this thing, but this thing's more of the intercom system. Rather than a phone. But I'll come. This floor is officially... Come on. Come on. There you go. This floor is done. We don't need to come back here at all. I highly doubt there's a shiny coin thing for me to shoot as well. I checked literally every single room. There's just no point coming back here. I'll be re-examining every other... Every room before or after beating the game. Just to see if I can find those floaty coin things. Unless I can find a... A walkthrough online or a guide of someone who's found them all just, you know, just find out what the fuck it's for, if not... So, like, getting all of them's probably from some kind of cheat mode, like infinite ammo, if anything. But okay, with that done... Um... So we got the key... Four... Was it floor four? Floor four, okay. Back to floor four. I'm gonna assume, since I have the magnet in my inventory, it's just gonna work. Didn't say anything about magnet being attached to the car, so let's uh, let's assume I put the magnet on it. I don't know, man. No, oh, okay. And there we go. With the number seven six one. Floor seven. I don't. Less. Oh, no, never mind. For the next door. Okay, for a key for here. I'm just gonna equip the shotgun for the sake of it. Jump scare. Werewolf. God damn it. A literal jump scare. A literal jump scare of all jump scares, of course. Jeez, long-lasting and deliberately fucking a scalpel. Dissect soft tissue. Of course they do a obnoxious fucking bullshit fucking jump scare. Jesus Christ. Due to new equipment for retina scanning, sometimes there are some problems with getting into the laboratory. Professor Cohen, please add Anna, Elizabeth, Gregory, Nikolai to the admission number we know. Blah, 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 blah. That's right. so, okay. so we need to cut someone's eye with a scalpel. Gotcha. But now my inventory is completely fucked. Holy shit, though, they're giving me a lot of shit. Um... I still don't appreciate the jump scare, but, you know. Um, we'll have to go... Oh, the save's at the start. Yeah, I don't... I, want, I just want to drop this now. And what is this, like, ink? I think it's just ink. Psychox. So we need this to get to the floor, so this isn't some secret room. <sighs> like, is there anything I can do? Maybe just shoot my pistol rounds? I can't drop anything. Um, I really don't want to run back and forth. I, I don't want to. You know what I'm going to do? I, I just don't want to run back and forth. Ink. Okay. We're done. Oh yeah, there's also this. That's machine gun ammo? Fucking <laughs> I wanted to- oh, it's right there even. I, I'd rather take this, honestly. I don't care for the ink. I have enough out of it, I, I'm not gonna run out. But, um... My only other question is... 
werewolf in here? Oh god. Yes! Shoot! Burn! I knew there was a werewolf in there. I just wasn't a hundred percent sure. We entered this one though. Yeah, okay, that will have the machine gun in it. We technically didn't need to burn them, so I wouldn't be coming back here anyways. Because I just want to make sure I find the fucking coin things, you know? What if... What if... They are only on this floor, it was my other theory, but... No evidence. I don't know, I think we're just basically done this entire floor. I'll just mark it off, whatever. We have a scalpel, we need to find someone's eyeball to cut out. I'm going to assume that the person that is the... Oh, uh, wait. I'm going to the 8th floor, right? Yes. I'm going to assume that I was wrong about the generator, but we need the eyeball, I think, of the boss. The boss is probably one of the people transformed that have the retina to be scanned, so I'll kill the boss, keep the eye, although if I roast him in the oven, the eye would technically melt, so I... Who knows, man? Who knows? Oh, yeah. I'm not in the mood. Big boy... No. A whole lot of zombies. I don't think I'll need to burn them. But... Eh. At least the plant things are no longer here. Gonna switch my pistol with the machine gun. Ugh. I uh, can probably put away the, the radio remote. Put away the useless note. Uh, scalpel, I'll probably keep. Hammer, I don't think I'll need any more, honestly. When I go to the new floors I haven't gone to, I'll probably re-pick it up, though. Otherwise... Let's take two of these. Use... No, oh, yellow plant's strong, damn. Alright, well, fuck it. With that said and done... Hmm. I guess we'll just save it and then uh, check out see if we can run into the boss. Wait, how am I still holding the pistol? <laughs> there we go. That makes more sense. Okay, so we don't have the key for the generator as I was theorizing. We're just gonna go to the possible boss room. Let's see if we can cook something. Why not? I wanna see if I can get their eye. This this is the exact same stairwell at level nine. Interesting. Fucking fishy ass boss room. Yep. Is he invisible? Kool Aid Man? I need that eyeball. How do I open the oven? Yeah, a little faster. I don't even think I need to shoot at it, honestly. Seven, nine, eight, seven, six, I don't want to be in here myself! Alright, he got stuck in the wall. The fuck is this random, just stupid design, man? What? Oh, damn. That's how I'm supposed to kill him. Don't crush me, please. Let's try that again. God, this music sucks. Okay, I need you closer. Come on. The thing, like... Come on. Seriously. Well, alright. I, it closes slowly, so I could have not been so pressured to leave so early, but 
We I need to open the valve when he's really close. Like this should be okay. I don't want to get too close. Okay. Come on. Come on. Here. Oh, okay. Seriously. He backed away. He's either really smart, or the AI is really stupid. I'm gonna say it's the latter. Come on. Into the fucking room. I swear to God, mister. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yep. Nope. Oh, what? What? How am I supposed to cut your eye? What? But his eyeball's gone. Was it? Oh. Oh, there it is. I'm guessing I'm supposed to shoot his eye when he walks in the room so he doesn't back off? Or he's he can see so he knows not to walk in the oven. Okay. Come on. There. It's because his eye, he, he could see that he doesn't want to walk in there, and then when his eye is gone, he suddenly loses his intelligence and... What? Fuck, is serious? Why is he not dead? Why did zombies spawn? Why is he still okay? Do I have to do it repeatedly? What? This is so fucking bugged. What the f- like, are, are, Isn't it just supposed to melt him and that's it? Do I have to do it multiple times or is it too close to the door and it didn't count? Why did zombies spawn? I'm injured. I'm critical. Can it, no? Can you can you die this time? I have to do it repeatedly, I guess. Just gotta make sure I don't get hit by the stupid fucking zombies. One more shot. One, like one more hit, and I'm dead. The zombies, good. Alright, open up. Give me your eyeball. Whatever the fuck I'm supposed to manage from you. Cooking a thing three times is just stupid. Ten. Uh, nine, okay. Eight, seven, Still six, prepping, is it? Okay. Five, four, Nothing? Three, two, one. But where, where's the eye? What was the point of all of this? Why is it counting down when I don't even pull the fucking lever? Oh, gee, what the... No, oh, maybe I'm... Wait, hold on. I, just in case they spawn more zombies after that. I wasn't expecting zombies to magically peer out of thin fucking air. Like, where do they come from, huh? There's no vents. And they just poof in, for, into existence. Dumbest thing I've ever seen. But alright. We're going to be cutting this guy and getting another jump scare. Stab. 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 How many times am I stabbing Seven, him? Six, five, eight, 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 two, one. Yeah, cool story. I got his eye. Alright, we're weak. I hope I don't get killed. I didn't get the boss's eye, but I got an eye that was in the boss's room. It'd been cooler if I killed the monster and took its eye, but... Whatever, I guess. But then it leaves the question... A key is required for this. I'll be coming to this floor, meaning 
the monsters on this floor that I've not burned, they're just gonna come back. But that's gonna be a pain in the ass somewhat, but whatever, I guess. I am really fucking weak and hurt. I'm gonna assume the plant's color has nothing to do with poison and shit. It's just green is the weakest, purple and yellow. Purple is like the best at healing and yellow's the second best. I'm assuming that's how it is instead. So, whatever. Alright, I'm gonna save it here. I think I'm just done. <laughs> for now. Not not done done, but just done for now. Oh, can't even hold more than uh, five eggs per. Cool. Um, I'm gonna just like have my inventory like this. We know we're going to go... But that, that door's fucked. We'll have to come back for a generator key. But we're going to go to... We need to figure out how to get to the seventh floor. Yeah. So basically, our next step is... Like, the seventh floor is pretty big, to be honest. But uh, we'll be using the eye to get to level 7. But more or less. Level 8, there's only one room left. Level 7 is not all done. Level 6... Let's just let's just claim it's done. Let, I'm going to just put the X as the indicator. 4 or 5... Actually, we haven't done anything in 4 or 5. I'm going to assume it's the escape route, though. 4 4 are done. 3 is done. 2 is done. 1 is done. And 0... Just that one room. What is specific about that room? We need bolt cutters. I'm guessing we're going to get that in 4 or 7. Then I'll have to retrace of all the floors. Actually, you know what? I think I only need bolt cutters for... What floors? For 2? Reception room. I don't think I needed bolt cutters here at all. I'm trying to remember where I saw bolts. I know bolts are needed for 4 0. So basically, I just need. The bolt cutters for floor zero and five. Don't think I needed it for anything else. Yeah, I guess that's it. Just two places so far. But I'm curious on why the bolt for that one room, but we'll find out eventually. Either way, I hope you enjoyed and look forward to the few remaining episodes left of Ebola 2. Ugh. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button. Become a fluff subscriber. Put the notification down below for updates on my videos. Thank you for watching. Until the next time. Mm.